The Centipede's Colorful Shoes Once upon a time, in a cozy little forest, lived a friendly and cheerful centipede named Charlie. Charlie was special because he had a hundred legs, making him the fastest crawler in the entire forest. But there was one thing that made him sad. He had plain, boring shoes. One sunny morning, as Charlie was taking his daily stroll through the forest, he noticed a group of insects gathered near a big tree. Curiosity got the better of him, and he decided to join them. To his surprise, there was a shoe fair taking place, where all the insects were showcasing their unique footwear. Charlie's eyes sparkled with excitement as he saw shoes of all shapes, sizes, and colors. There were ladybugs flaunting polka dot shoes, butterflies fluttering around in delicate wing-shaped shoes, and even a grasshopper wearing bouncy, spring-loaded shoes. Charlie couldn't help but feel a tinge of envy. He longed for a pair of colorful shoes that would match his vibrant personality. Determined to find the perfect pair, he approached one of the vendors, a wise old snail named Samuel. Excuse me, Mr. Samuel, Charlie said, his voice filled with hope. Do you have any shoes that would fit a centipede like me? Samuel smiled kindly and replied, Why, of course, my friend, I have just the thing for you. He led Charlie to a small corner where a variety of shoes were displayed. Among them, Charlie spotted a dazzling pair of rainbow-colored sneakers. These are called Spectra shoes, Samuel explained. They are made especially for centipedes like you. Each leg will have its own unique color. Charlie's eyes widened with excitement. He couldn't believe his luck. He quickly tried on the shoes, and to his amazement, each of his hundred legs was adorned with a different color. His heart danced with joy, and he couldn't wait to show off his new footwear to his friends. As Charlie made his way back home, he couldn't help but notice the amazed and cheerful faces of the forest creatures he passed. Everyone was impressed by his beautiful shoes and they couldn't help but smile. Even the usually grumpy old owl, Owen, cracked a smile and hooted his approval. From that day forward, Charlie's colorful shoes became the talk of the forest. All the animals admired his unique style, and soon, they started calling him Charlie the Colorful Centipede. Charlie felt a sense of pride and happiness that he had never experienced before. But amidst all the attention and admiration, Charlie remained humble and kind. He would often invite his friends to join him for strolls in the forest, and together they would have races, dance, and laugh in delight. One day, as Charlie was enjoying a delightful picnic with his friends, he noticed a lonely snail sitting by himself. Charlie approached him and introduced himself, realizing it was Samuel, the shoemaker. Hello, Mr. Samuel, Charlie greeted him warmly. Would you like to join us? We are having a fantastic time. Samuel looked surprised but smiled gratefully. Thank you, Charlie. I've been watching you and your friends from afar. It warms my heart to see how your shoes have brought so much joy to everyone. From that day on, Samuel became an integral part of Charlie's group of friends. He shared his wisdom, and together, they created even more magical shoes for all the forest creatures to enjoy. And so, the forest remained a place filled with laughter, friendship, and the most fashionable feet. All thanks to Charlie, the centipede with the colorful shoes.